Once you've selected the right vehicle, now it's time to make the deal. Dealership practices vary, so you may be working with your salesperson or a manager, but whoever is doing the pricing, it should be total price. That means all costs to you except taxes and government fees. There shouldn't be any surprises later. First I met the sales manager. We agreed on the price and I confirmed all the fees were included. He told me about some financing options that I would be able to compare with my bank loan. So I put down a deposit to hold the car while I arranged everything. I looked over the deposit agreement to make sure it was clear. I wasn't expecting any problems, but I wanted to make sure that I could get my deposit back if my bank loan did not come through. So I made it a condition of the deposit agreement. Once you've agreed on a price for the vehicle, you may end up completing the process with the dealership's business office. When you're finalizing the financing or payment details, you may be offered additional optional services. Same rule applies. Stay alert and only agree to the options that you need. After looking at all the options, I decided to finance the loan through my bank. I was also offered an optional warranty and a theft protection package. I was sure I'd researched everything, but I forgot about warranties. I did know that my insurance would provide theft protection. The business office made arrangements for ICBC insurance and prepared the transfer documents so that I could pick up the car the next day. My friend told me he knew a place I could have bought a car for less, but I told him that price wasn't the only thing. I felt better knowing the full history and mechanical condition of the car I was buying, and from a dealership I could trust. He always brags about how little he paid for his vehicle, but it's caused him nothing but grief from the day he bought it. I'd done my homework. I knew what I needed, and I knew what I could afford. I knew what to look for and what to ask for at the dealership. I was confident that I was buying a quality used car from a professional dealer. When I came back the next day after my financing was approved, the car was ready for me. I reviewed the documents and got copies of everything, including the inspection and history reports, and I put them in a safe place. If I have any questions in the future, those documents will help me resolve them. Looking back, my experience was totally different from my buddies. I had a plan, and knowing what I bought really gives me peace of mind.